I'm not really sure if we were really ever married, but uh, let's just suffice it to say, it's kind of loud, let me roll the window up here. I am divorcing, okay, I'm divorcing the pro-life movement. And so since there's not a certificate, I can't think, I'm not a Muslim, but I can't think of any better way than to make this clear than by repetition. And I think the Muslims have a good point here. So let's say the pro-life movement is here. We'll, um, we'll just imagine like it's, it's a woman, right? And I'm taking her outside my house in front of the community and everyone. And I'm saying, I divorce you, I divorce you, I divorce you, okay? I am divorcing the pro-life movement and I'm including AHA, the little cult around little little T. Russell Hunter, little dragon slayer T. Russell Hunter. Oh, I'm a mighty warrior T. Russell Hunter. Yeah, AHA, who is always criticizing the pro-life movement, who essentially stole, and by the way, I wouldn't mind if you were doing, if you were really moving to abolish abortion, but you guys essentially stole uh, Neil Horsley's idea and mine. Um, we were, we, we, we started the Abortion Abolitionist magazine. I still have the domain, abortionabolitionist.com. Uh, and you ran with it, and I, I don't mind. I was very hopeful that you were really gonna do it, but when you guys, pretending to be different, in the pro-life movement, actually built into at abolishhumanabortion.org, built into your um, statements, the, uh, the, the position that it is, and I quote, evil. You say it's evil to defend the preborn with force without the authorization of magistrates. That's a lie. In reality, you don't take that position with your own children. Neither does Rusty Thomas. Neither does Matt Turella. That's a lie. It's a goddamned lie. It's not a peripheral lie. It's a lie that's right at the heart of the issue, which, and the issue supposedly was, are the preborn persons People, are they persons? Do they deserve the same kind of defense, the same kind of personhood that you and I do? Yes, I know, I'm not giving it to them. That's a failure on my part. I need other people's help, but we're never getting anywhere. Mark my words, we are never getting anywhere. Anywhere, and you're no different, AHA, than the pro-life movement, and we're never getting anywhere when we, at the core of who we are, refuse to acknowledge that they deserve, the preborn deserve the same material defense that you would want to give your own children or yourself if the government said you don't deserve a defense with a gun or any by any other means. I'm not advocating this. There's a distinction, but there is an important, crucial moral principle here. So I divorce you too, although you divorced me a long time ago. AHA has, never, has always slandered me and, uh, and, 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 and had to... Uh, uh, felt apparently compelled to do that uh, because uh, uh, not not really because of my own personal failures I'm sure I have uh, I know I have uh, personal failures but that's but it's because I say the preborn deserve the same defense as the born okay start saying that and I'll start supporting you and really who cares whether I support you or not maybe you don't care uh, maybe it doesn't matter whether I support you it does matter whether the Holy Spirit of God supports you okay because he knows the preborn deserve the same defense as the born now to troy newman <laughs> to troy newman basically what all of you are is pressure relief valve mechanisms okay that's what the pro-life movement is uh, jeff white says oh we're still rescuing oh uh, rescue never stopped rescue was a success uh, uh troy newman uh, says uh, it, he's the leader of Operation Rescue, but in reality, nobody's being rescued. Nobody has for years. We capitulated. We failed. And by uh, instead of uh, defining the failure as failure and acknowledging and confessing the failure, uh, we went on to redefine failure as success and continue to raise funds and annoy the pro-choicers. I see your fundraising letters. I'm also on the fundraising uh email lists of Planned Parenthood, of Utah, Colorado, National, all of them. They're the same boilerplates, okay? You guys just use each other, as Paul DePerry pointed out many years ago, uh, it's money in, money out. Babies in, money out, okay? And, you, and, and pro-life and pro-choice use the same boilerplates. It's the political football that keeps everybody posing, 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 but in reality, nobody's abolishing. And T. Russell Hunter, you're the same. And Troy Newman, uh, who said Scott Roeder was a coward, you told me on the phone, and I've been chewing on this for two years, that the FBI was on your case, and that forced you to say Scott Roeder was a coward. God damn it, that's a lie. And I'm not using the Lord's name in vain. That is a God 
damned lie. You did not have to say Scott Ritter was a coward to avoid uh, being prosecuted by the FBI. You're a liar, Troy. Uh, Rob says that your wife says you're a liar. Rob Rudnick, okay? Sorry, Rob, if you didn't want me to uh, repeat that, but I am, because it's, it's important. <laughs> uh, you're, Troy's a liar. Troy's a liar. You didn't have to say Scott Roeder was a coward. More importantly, Scott Roeder is not a coward. Okay, so Troy, Scott Roeder is not a coward. You're a liar. Repent. I'm divorcing the pro-life movement. Uh, T. Russell Hunter, it is not evil to defend preborn persons with force. You're a liar. Okay, Troy, you're a coward. Okay, Hunter, you're a liar. Okay? And me too, I'm a coward because I don't defend them, but at least I'm going to speak the truth. Okay, Matt, Truella, it is not okay. <laughs> Matt, Truella, it is not okay. Uh, no matter what you think your God who doesn't know the future says, it is not okay to associate uh, with organizations, AHA and uh, OSA. OSA calls for the murder of Paul Hill. And uh, AHA um, actually says it is evil to defend preborn children. And I reiterate, Matt, it is not okay to uh, become a member of these organizations to, to share and wear and promote their uh, uh, emblems and their leadership, when in reality their leadership has defined through the press releases and through the organizational statements, which are online and accessible to anyone, uh, lies as part of their core doctrine. If, if you're going to associate with them, you've got to clarify publicly the way they uh, did the press releases, your points of disagreement. Then you have a, a kind of uh, association, just like I can work with Muslims, just like anyone could work with anybody else. Uh, but you've got to clarify, otherwise you're a collaborator with their goddamn lies. Okay? So I'm divorcing the stupid pro-life movement and the people who are pretending to be the radicals in it. And now, um, uh, yeah, Jeff White too. All right, so um, that's all I can think of right now. I've got to go back to work, uh, but I'm divorcing you. I divorce you. I divorce you. You are liars. You are pressure relief mechanisms that are designed to keep this from ever being resolved. And by the way, there are no feminists for life. You're a joke. Feminism means death. It is irredeemable. There are no feminists for life. So Frederica Matthews Green, uh, I used to be your son's friend. Uh, I was there at your house. You were so hospitable. Your, 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 your husband priest was, uh, of the Orthodox Church. You were wonderful, hospitable people. But to hell with feminists for life. Okay? To hell with it. Feminism equals death. We got into this problem by giving women the vote. Okay? They are not authorized to govern men. Okay? And that led to contraception. And that led to abortion. And as long as you people define... Uh, your uh, fake, lying, uh, pretentious uh, defense of the preborn in terms, as long as you define your fake defense of the preborn in terms of what women find acceptable, you're going to keep failing and keep lying and keep uh, saying things that don't make any sense and that quench and grieve the Holy Spirit until God eventually applies the same standard to your children as you've applied to his.